Okay, welcome back. Uh, this is Muhammad Harun Idris. Today we have 2013. That means 2005, 6, 7, uh, some a little bit different, but 2013, uh, 14, 11, 12 BMW X5 uh, 3.0 liter. We have a problem with uh, this car is shutting off while you are driving. As usual, um, um, what we do is always when you have a problem or customer complain of something, do not try to go and change part. Try just to go in and look if there is any codes or anything and try to duplicate the problem. It by driving test or anything. So now I am using the interface, BMW interface, and I will go inside, look for if there is any code. Right now the check engine light is not on, but I will try to, to see if there is any code. I'm using my um, BMW ISTA. Easter A because it has Easter A and Easter B. This is offline. Um, there is also uh, online brand or online online uh, version that you can pay by day, and you can do the same thing that I'm doing it here: programming, coding, and diagnosing the car. Now I'm gonna go slowly and click on read out vehicle data. This one here it will check the interface first. So I'm gonna go check here. It will give you the interface. And from there, you're going to click on the interface. Okay, double click. And then it will it will start reading the VIN number. You see on the right side here. On the left side, you have VIN number, BMW, X5, engine N55, mileage 132, all-wheel drive. Production date is 01 October 2012. Off-road vehicle, X5, X-Drive, 335i. Auto, you know the gear is automatic it will give you all the detail even the paint coat that means if you take this coat here the p0475 uh, and uh, and this is the a blast for coat uh, this is the body coat if you take this one here and you put it into a color code uh, analytic system it will give you exactly um, what color that so, uh, the painting is now I'm gonna go here to do the vehicle test now the car is running this one here it will look for all modules you see the diagram in front of you are the module that is for this car module with the green it module that is healthy no code and is communicating okay module with gray module is there communicating but there is a code there is a fault in it so if we look at it right now even though sometimes the, the, the code is not available in the engine computer or not yet tricked, it will be in there in the car. So right now I have 12 codes. I have 12 codes. So now let me break it down. I will go to say display the codes. Okay, right now you see message. First one, the 12 code is a footwell module. Missing received disk transmitting footwell module. Aerial, one of the aerial, that means the one that's sending signal to door lock, unlock, or something. The cast is starter motor. Rear lid motor. Okay, rear, you know the rear lid, the trunk, that means. And when we go down, I'm look, I'm seeing, I don't see anything. Okay, now I have how many left? Okay, no message. No uh, sensor secured. DME received from frame. Electronic transmission control. No message display transmission data from the electronic transmission control. Wow, that's very funny. So the the code it could be inside the transmission. So let me calculate it. That's very funny. So now when we go here, I'm not, okay. Here I see power train. HKL power train. That's what I'm getting in the engine tr in the tr in, uh, in the power train. But I don't see nothing else. So let me go to the power train and see what is mean. Okay. But that's very funny. I'm gonna display it. What does that mean? Hmm. 
still we don't have nothing we don't have nothing that related Uh, here is talking about automatic lift gate module so have nothing to do with uh, you see this is a gateway module I mean the lift gate module we have a code on the left and right side um, this is a wiring diagram for it but I don't see anything for the engine it just say that the transmission is not is not seeing we are not seeing anything from the transmission here yeah, I want to get out I want to go out of here check communication system okay aerial and basic air conditioning cars I don't see no quotes we don't have no quotes for car shutting while you're driving I'm not sure if there is any problem or what but this car as you remember the car is shut off I believe I need the key. The key is with the customer. So I'm gonna get the key and we're still looking for it, but I don't see any code related to to water valve, heat and air conditioning. Okay. Okay, I have the key back because this car is a proximity system. Okay. This is our problem. When you try to start it, the car try to start or not. You see? You see? The car try to start and it doesn't want to start. We don't know why. Okay, this problem in this car was that uh, the car have the, the, the ground wire between the engine and the battery which is a body was broke we replaced that one the battery was replaced brand new from the dealer um, this car came here to the shop before was shut down is completely no good now the battery was new uh, we changed a lot of stuff you know you try to start it you see is is fail you see That's our problem. So, and there is no code. You drive the car, car drive good. You come, you park, you try to start it. The car doesn't want to start. All the product, all the stuff in this car was replaced. The, everything replaced in this car. Okay, but I'm not sure. Let me go back. I'm gonna delete all this code. Delete for memory. Yes. Sometimes it starts, sometimes it doesn't want to start. Computer is okay. Uh, the ground. So you guys switch the ignition off, take the key out. Okay. This battery is new. Uh, everything look good on this car. Okay, I'm gonna put this one inside. So now we don't know why. When you try to start the car, the car doesn't want to start. Like you have to, if you jump it. You know, now we have like only one or two coats or four coats. One is the junction box. One one is on the AC. Even the cable, the battery cable, on on the on the ground side was being replaced. Okay, let me see what I have. You see this Hall effect. Uh, something related to. I believe the rear the rear trunk but we don't have any problem with okay let me see now see yeah you see when you try to start it it doesn't want to start at all you know like you try to start it it doesn't want to start so now we have to know what exactly why what happened to it and the whole problem in this car, what we replace, I'm going to show you. We rep this is what happened from the beginning. You see, if you come here, you see the ground wire. 
this is this small ground wire this wire is broke and this wire is the ground wire from the engine from the body to the star what we did is we changed this one and now we're getting I don't know if we're getting voltage drop or what happened we don't know but the battery is good but it's not starting we will look for this one and see Raymond you're gonna give us a booster give me a booster give me a jump a jumper or a booster see if it's gonna start you see We didn't change this, we the but we, yeah, but we never, yeah, yeah, just put me another star, let me see, maybe the star have a little bit of, but this, this one, you put after market star, you put after market star, but, but I see that here, it's going to be 9 volt, when we, when I try to crank it, is is the voltage, the voltage dropped to 9 volt, very severe, yeah, I see here on the data, when I try to crank it, hold, hold, now it's 11.8, right? It's, 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 when I try to crank it, it's go to 9 volt. 9 is too, it's too, it's too, it's no good. Is that 9, it's dropped to 9, why? Because from where? Let's try to put a, a jumper and see in the front. Put it in front and see if it's gonna be okay. If it's not, then we have to see why we're getting the voltage drop. Sometimes, sometimes those car, sometimes those car, they need, they need a, Star that not pulling, not drawing too much current. If the star is after, if the star is after market, also maybe it will drain too much. Okay. So let's let's. You did. Okay. Let me see if it's gonna go down. It's ten. It's good. It's 10. Yeah, it's go to 10. Yeah, it's go 10, but before it's 9 point something. It's, not, it's going 9. There is something draining this battery when we pull. Maybe so, either the, the star is draining too much current and it doesn't start. Maybe star is defect or you need a dealer star. I'm not sure, but it's not something is wrong with, uh, with the drain pull or, or we can look for the, the, the battery ground there is it if the ground is okay while you're cranking or not we don't want we don't need anything to but it's hmm? yeah yeah we ground wire but we just want to be sure that everything is reaching here correctly good I and mean, everything is good i believe maybe the star droning too much current and if this car the star draining too much current the battery going to limb mode like to sleep could be or there is something wrong somewhere that pulling the pulling the, the voltage very down. I'm not sure what it is, but so we're gonna we're gonna check this car and then we will update you maybe in another video for what's happening or what's going on. So now as long as you see the chopper is drop it's dropped very, very bad. As soon as it started, it started for me. It's dropped to nine. nine, dropped to nine. Yeah. Yeah, drop to nine. It's not supposed to drop to nine. nine. Go. Drop to nine. nine is no good. Yeah. It dropped very bad. Is that because of the grounds or power? We need to know. Or maybe. Check the ground, go see. Yeah, check all the ground. Yeah. You understand? And, and power. Let me see here. Can you, can you? Okay, hold on. Can you crank it for me again? The ground here look good. Can you crank it? Yes, yes, there is a ground problem. Let's go to five something. Go again. Go again. No, no, no. Ground have more than half volts. The ground have more than half volt. It's no good. The ground is have more. Let me open the trunk. I have a 500 millivolt. That's too bad. Open it for. Thank you. Let me reach the battery now. 
because it shouldn't it shouldn't drop. Let me get it. Let me get something. It's not good. I'm gonna get some things for you. You do it. Yeah. Okay, leave it now again. Okay. Now you see here is good. Here the the ground is perfect. You okay, one sec, one second. We're gonna open this. We're gonna see the pole. So uh, I hold this one. When I ground on the engine is very weak. The ground is, is very weak on the because here when I put it is zero zero voltage drop which is good but so on the maybe, engine maybe, maybe losing ground on the in front yeah, somewhere somewhere losing ground too. Yeah. maybe that that piece you tight it also maybe need to clean it good what piece I'm gonna go check it now the ground from here to to the to the body if it's okay because here we have no problem. Here I have no problem, but when I put the ground on the engine, it's missing half volt. That's too much. I shouldn't I shouldn't miss anything. Ground is supposed to be zero zero in all time. But half a volt is too much. You got it, Raymond? Mm -hmm. The other car is good, you never come back, the same issue. This is the ground, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, here. Okay, can you? Can ground you? Here. Yeah. I got it. I got it. You see, ground is good. Mm -hmm. Okay, one second. One second. Yeah, it's good there. I see some. Go again. Thank you. Again. It's ten. Ten also could be okay. So. We're not gonna. Okay, now let me see here. Go. Crank. You see, voltage is zero. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Go. Here is good. Okay. Now let's see here on the on the on the ground that we have it. Well, no, it's okay. I'm already down. Okay, let me see here. Go. Yeah, here is losing a little bit again. Okay, let me see in the. Let's go. Go. One more. One more. Again. Raymond, when when you put here on. One more. Yeah. Again, okay, Raymond. And here is going like zero point something volt. Hold on, let me check. Collect my stuff there. Okay, sorry. Raymond, do it here again for me. Raymond, yeah. I feel even the star is hot. Just do it one more for me. Yeah, 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 no. There is a ground issue here. Between between there to, to, to the body. Let me check here. One more. On the body is okay, Raymond, do me a favor. You know what you need? You know what you need to do? Come. Give me a ground from here. From here to the engine and then we see what happens. From here, any ground from here to the engine, because the engine now when you try to crank it, mm. even when you try to crank it, it, it drop half a volt. Okay. That's too much. Mm. Okay. Okay. Now, this we we give ground to the battery. We have ground to the battery, and we give ground directly from the booster to to the engine. So let's start it now. Turn it off and start it. You see, charging is good. Charging is 15 point something. Turn it off. 
Now let me take it. Let me take this. Okay, start it now. Start. Beautiful. You see how it is? Whoa, 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 whoa. Turn it off. Okay, I'm gonna take this one out. It may start a couple of minutes then because okay, start it again. Start. Yeah, again. Dead, right? He he don't wanna do nothing. Okay, now let me put the let me put the booster. And the ground have to be in the car. Oh, if I move good. this ground here, it will not start. Start now. Yes, I know, man. Thank you for... Guys, here is our problem now. now. See you in another video. We're going to put this a ground crazy. between the engine to the transmission and then we come back. This is the whole problem for this car from the beginning. We have 20 minutes working on it. Now the car is start of quarter starting. That ground that I showed you before, it, it messed up. We put that ground, but we don't know what get effect there, if there's any other ground somewhere. But we are, what we are going to do, we are going to take one ground from here to the engine, any place in the engine, even here, it's okay. We're going to look for a good place. And then this car will never have a problem again. Thank you for watching. And um, this is Mobile Electronic Diagnostic. Please uh, like, share, and subscribe, and see you in another video.